ciambella. Ok. Eh, Uno? Buono. Grazie. One ciambella. Cosimo, brucia, tieni, tieni. Aspetta, tieni. Oh, brucia, brucia. She can be the hot one, eh, of course, because sì. she doesn't want to Saggia, hold it. saggia. We are in Sidi Bou Said and it's very famous because when you go around it, it makes you think you're in Greece. Ooh. There's all the white houses with blue doors. It's pretty cool. Now we're going for a walk to check out some of these beautiful blue doors and white houses. Hey, there's plenty of blue here. Have a look with them, have a look. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the artisan area where you still see all the white and blue houses but with a bunch of shops. They all have these little flowers they sell. They say they bring good luck. Thank you. No, thank you. Guys, who knows? We might get some lunch to go. Brennan, you'll yeah, see the future of this video. Skip to the future. Shh. You've seen too much already. Goodbye. Where are we getting? Bomboloni. Mm. Or, what about the other? Oh, is it I think it's bomboloni. Well, for us, it's bomboloni. Maybe it's bomboloni. It's basically a. Or fried, something like that. A free, fried kind of pizza dough. Is it in the line? Or is there a line? I don't know. As you can see, right when I said it, we found something to eat. Ciambella. Okay. <laughs> One ciambella, Cosimo, brucia, tieni, tieni, tieni. Oh, brucia, brucia. She can be the hot one, eh, of course, because sí. she doesn't want to hold it. Saggia, You've seen too much already. My mommy's trying it. Thank you, try it. Mm. Oh. You see, we have our grandparents. Oh, this is nonni. Do you like to have a backward no, information? No, 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 no. <laughs> this is the nonno. Oh. Mm. 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 So this is also a pretty expensive area. When we were looking for an Airbnb to stay, we also looked into places here, but it wasn't in our budget. Let's put it that way. <laughs> so all we can do is walk around these pretty streets and just enjoy being here for the day. Not the prettiest day today, a little bit, let's say, foggy. But mm. still, look at this. Mm -hmm. Imagine that house, what a view it has. We stopped at this place and we had this amazing meal. 
the best pizza I've had in so long. The pizza is really, really good. Wow. It's real Na Napolitan pizza. And now they brought us a special treat, a little dessert. Luca wow. is very excited about it. Strawberry sauce or okay. jam. Is it good? Yeah, it's good. The way they serve it, it's really pretty. And then tea or coffee for me. And they've been so friendly. They showed us their oven and and here they make the pizza. Look, they have all the ingredients and it's real Napolitan pizza. Wow! Look, uh -huh. really cool place. And the pizza, how is the pizza, Luca? Good! They have a little play area for the kids. And they have like a playground area for the kids over there. It's a really cool place. Luca works here now. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're making a Nutella milkshake? Yeah. Okay, I'm making Nutella dirty. ice cream. I'm going Nutella. Oh, wow, Luca. So we can be like. Okay, Luca's working here now. <gasps> Did they hire you as the new barista? Oh, wow, really? Jella. Oh my gosh. Luca, you are pretty lucky right now, huh? Oh. What's your name? Okay. Chalky. Chalky. So here we are at Jasmine Cafe, right? Jasmine. Ra Jasmine. Jasmine. <laughs> so this is the owner of the place and it's really nice person. The place is really nice. The appetizer is really good. So if you come here to Tunis, please stop here because it's a really nice place. Grazie. So guys, when you travel with kids, one of the most important things that you need to find in every city is the playground. Here we are at Sidi Bou Said playground and we found plenty of spots in this park where the kids can play. So how does this thing work? Uh, you gotta do like this, but it's kind of broken. This is for chatting, right? Yeah. You just have a conversation while you're playing. And mommy just fell. And I just fell. Yeah. I'll show you a little quick snippet of it. Okay, Cosimo's gonna show what happened. This is young mama and uh, Luca, pretend to be me. So she was walking with her camera and then, oh, psh, oh and then she sat there sitting. Did I start with the... Oh, oh, oh that, that's definitely what happened. <laughs> young mama. Oh. And Cosimo on my lap? Yeah. Oh, was that daddy? Um, uh, Maybe it was daddy. <laughs> Okay, we're back in Sidi Bou Said for one last look before we leave Tunisia and we're gonna go see the lighthouse which we didn't see the other day. It's right here. We're also trying to get our kids tired. No, nothing. I just got tricked the whole time. I don't need to drive because we're actually trying to get us tired. So keep on running. Oh, it's closed. But you can see the lighthouse. Beautiful view. Let's go see another viewpoint. You are gonna be quiet. So 
Zoe, whose city was I then? He was a, an old man. Each year people come like from all over Tunisia to pay respect to, to him. Yeah, saint. like saint. Like okay. saint. And he it's, lived in here? He saint. was living here, exactly. They buried Buried him here. Oh, see it. Oh. He came here from where? Oh, he's Tunisian. He came from uh, Beja. And he came to live here? Exactly, because it was like an empty place, so he came here to pray. Pray, just pray. It was like just a mountain. And there was nothing here. There was nothing. And everything and was, yeah. was built after he was dead? After, exactly. Oh, okay. Yeah, so people like was uh, were coming to Sidi Bosaid to pray and to ask for things from God. Miracle. Yeah, exactly. And then people went here to build houses and then bigger houses and then bigger houses. Did they also build because they felt it was more of a holy place because exactly. he was here? Ah. Yeah, no, it's the holy place. It's Sidi Bosaid is a holy place. Uh, yeah, but for many tourists, it's just a nice place because it looks like exactly. Greece. <laughs> The two last weeks in Ramadan, like people come here, you will find like full here. People are praying, praying. and there are horses on the road. They do like some music and they say, Oh, Sidi Busaid, oh, Sidi Busaid, oh, Sidi. Yeah. People come here, they put money inside in the box. Okay. So after that, the box like will go to poor people and will go to the festival that they do for Sidi Busaid. But can you go inside or it's closed? It's closed. Usually you can go inside. See, this is something we did not know. We knew the touristy part about it. That's a pretty place to go see because it looks like Greece. Ramadan and everything is closed except the little shops but no food yet this is where we got the bomboloni the other day <laughs> but no bomboloni now at least not yet so it's interesting to see the video we did the other day in the field there is now that everything that has food is closed and after breaking the fast you will find like this is so crowded and it's all sweets and coffee and tea. So in an hour, it's gonna get very exactly. busy here. We're not gonna be here to see it, but... <laughs> oh, <laughs> we saw it before Ramadan started and during the day. And now, and now it's almost the end of the day, so that it's gonna get dark. Everything is still closed, all the food stuff. Seriously, Emma? Run down. Run, 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 run! I win! No! Hi. Oh my god. I Blue and white is uh, a Jewish color. You know that? It was a place where Jewish lived. Lived. Ah. Oh. Yeah. But Sidi Bou Said wasn't Jewish. No. Okay. In Morocco, we went to see the, the blue, blue city. city. Yeah. And they said yeah. it wasn't only because of the religion. They did it because uh, during the sun we had a lot yeah. of mosquito. Yeah. And the blue and the white, they, they take exactly, away the yeah. mosquito. But they also said it was because it was Jewish yes, color. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. So they yes, had yes. different versions. Yeah. This is beautiful. This is really cool. Be careful not to roll down the mask. No, there's a lighthouse. But it used to be from place to fall. Yeah! Oh, oh, even for the ships which are coming from Italy and France from, because Italy and France are from here. There. So anything coming from here is. Go. Oh, I thought it's a picture. No fall!
What are you doing there? Go. We finished the video already. It's time to go. Bye. Subscribe. You were playing boss. Go over there and grab the thing, okay? Go! Hi there! Uh, you know you should have left about an hour ago. The story's finished. <laughs> well, anyway, see you later! Subscribe! Bye!